Main in the Biz, Chapter 45 Voice acted badly by Al Patron. That person in darkness, was it human or... Ding, 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 it's been a long time since I talked to anyone, so if I say anything weird, um, um, sorry. You're... You're not an Ahedi! A person on a sixth layer. Are you white, Whistle? Huh? Sixth layer. White. Eh. Sorry. Ma. My name is Velo Eluko. It's long. So I go by Veco. I'm probably human, I think. I've been naming the little ones here and singing them songs because I have a lot of free time. Right, Kati Chan? I don't know anything about the six layer or white things. I'm sorry. Uh -huh. Where are you? Why did you come to this dark, sticky place? <gasps> I'm Rico. I came here to looking for Reg and Nanachi. Reg? Um, how about Rohotsu, Sasu, Jin, Shishi, Fluffy? I want a robot and fluffy thing. Ngan, Gamadimo. I haven't seen them. Uh, I mean. Are they your friends? Those two? Yes! I looked everywhere and I couldn't find them, so I wondered if they came down here. Ah. Do you think it was that thing from before? Huh, Jesse? Possibly. I got that signal earlier. I might know one person who knows where to look. I would take you there, but... Look, I can't take this off myself, but if you... If you touch it with a strong desire to remove it, that should be enough. Hmm. Hmm. Are you a bad person? Uh, 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 oh. This village, Iruburu, the story of how it was founded isn't good. You could say that it's cursed. I was involved in the creation of the village. In the pits of hell, everything is paralyzed. And we were the creators of our own hell. And I couldn't do anything. I tried to oppose the creation of the village. And was sealed away in this darkness. But, but through the signals, I've been watching the village all this time. Despite its hideous beginnings, it's not that same horrible place anymore. It became our refuge for the children who were warped by the curse. The ones who lost their human bodies with only their soul left. And still, they keep going. What I was saying, oh, I am a bad person. I was blinded by greed, and I wanted to become more than human. I wanted more than to just come here. I'm sorry. The truth is, I don't care if you're a bad person. Will you please show me where to go? If I don't get there soon, it might be too late. <laughs> You're a good kid. Ma! Ma! Ma, son! Are you okay? I'm sorry. This is because I told you to come with me. That child was chosen by you. It should be difficult and painful for a child of the village to come here. Strong desire can overcome instinct. Right, Rico? Well, let us go. He probably wants to get out of here too. I have to climb this? No way, that's way too high. My legs are too weak. Hey. 
Here I come. Wow, amazing. This is what it's like now. I couldn't tell from all the signals. Um, do you have anything I can wear? It would be bad if anyone recognized me. Huh? Thanks, it's perfect. And now to the Irubur Village Fashion Show. Four legged pants as hoof, eight of these two dashed ones. Long coat for short, crawly legs, that included the cover's mouth. 23 of these two dashed ones and 13 of these single dashed ones. Delver's gloves, each unknown, which is rusty, each for only 86 single dashed ones. 4 meters of rope made from thread from water to sun, 6 double dashed and 15 single dashed ones, some part of a curtain, 5 double dashed ones, 2 bags made from all Botsu Sun's skin, 8 double dashed and 7 single dashed ones. Exposition panel, exposition panel, exposition panel. Untranslated Japanese. Untranslated Japanese. That's Hiragana! It's gotten a lot busier than it was earlier. I wonder what's going on. Ah, is it time for the invitation? Invitation? I've never seen it before. Couldn't it go after we're done? Walkie walkie, steppy steppy. Here, look. One of the three sages, Blafu, lives here. One of your friends should be inside. Hmm. I'm sorry, I can't go in there with you if they find out I escaped. Hadi would be bad. Would you be okay going without me? It's fine, just wait here. Ma son will go with me. Exposition battle, exposition battle. Steppy, 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 steppy. Hmm, Um, excuse me. Ah! Sound effect in Japanese, which I can't read. Well, should I go in? <gasps> uh, men me, men me. Um, I'm looking for Blafusan. Men me, men me. Hmm. <laughs> Steppy, 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 step. <gasps> Nanachi! Well, Nanachi, get out of there. Nanachi, Nanachi! Wait, human child. Ah! Ma, Mazi Kazia san? What's going on here? Hari, this is. Uh... Blunk? Ba! Banu, Banu Fuamo Hondi. A human child. Beautiful. Biraso. Hello, I am Blafu. What do you want? Um, I was looking for Nanache, and then I ended up here. Hey, Nanache! That fluffy thing, it sold itself. To buy me it back from me. They forfeited themselves. Even though I can't drink from it anymore, the fluffing energy will stay here forever. I'm glad I will have them here forever. Rizoichi, <laughs> I'm sorry, Kajia didn't know how important Miti was when I told Nanachi about this place. But then Nanachi had to come and see for themselves. Oh, yeah. <gasps> so, how the hell is that? Oh, no matter how much is left of Midi, she never runs out. It's not that Midi, it's Belafu's favorite. 
has just become what Balafu always eats. But Nanaji said, Please don't hurt Mitty like this anymore. Why did I give Nanachi a British accent? I don't know. Goodbye, Mitty. Nanachi sold themselves. Now, Hagu and Blafu has used a smoke to put them to sleep. <gasps> Wait a sec! Those eyes! You were the one who was with me before. Close. Very close. I remember. Thank you, Mitty. Airman child, do you know Mitty? Yes, she's very important to Nanachi, and she saved my life. Um, what would I have to do to get Nanachi and Mitty back? <laughs> Mitty was brought here by a masked man. He called himself the Lord of Dawn. On one of his many bits, he brought Mitty. I could tell from the smell it was a real immortal, an intermediary between a symbol of love and a strongly crystallized curse. In a sense, a personification of the abyss. I wanted it at all costs, but no matter what I offered him, he would not give her to me. Ma! Kapu! Huh. Wait, then how? I paid the price, and she was born into Iroburu. 724 arms and legs, half of my body, part of my sensory organs. I reduced them down and used their value. Every part of her, even her soul, perfectly reproduced. And for that, now she gave up everything. What do you plan to give me? <gasps> I don't know what I have to give. I still don't get it. Um, maybe if you told me, or rather, what would it take for you to give both of them back to me? If you give me your whole body right now. <gasps> um, I'm so bartering. Come on, think. But it's a lot more dangerous than when I tried it as a guide at the orphanage. Whole human children seem to be super valuable here. Isn't that greedy? How about my hair, which is very long? And five of my fingernails? And all the gear I have with me? Is that enough? Hmm. Maybe there was a little greedy. And... But that still is enough. Instead... I'll give you three choices. Both of your eyes, both of your legs, or half of your internal organs. I can't do any better than that. I want it all, but I will not be ready. I'll do everything I can to ensure it doesn't kill you. This Maiden Bis manga translation has been brought to you by 12-year-old boy scans. Translate by Shuro, editor Noku, proof Meterion. You can join them on their Discord at http colon slash slash chat dot dot me. This very crappily made voice acting of this chapter has been brought to you by Albatron.